these are my um, Mac Monaco wheels that I've bought for my Cayman and when they arrived they came from Italy the finish on the wheels initially looks quite nice but they didn't really sparkle properly so what I've done is spent some time with some compound polish and then I bought some of the turtle wax ceramic polish and wax and also the new paste version and it's improved them quite a fair bit they've much there's a much better gloss to the finish um, it, they, do, they were just a bit dull now the front are eight and a half inch wide rim and the rear is a dished design so the spokes go inwards and it's a ten and a half on the rear and I've fitted um, 295.30 by 20 for the rear and the front is 245.35 in the Michelin uh, Pilot Sport 4S now that's the tyre size for the GT4 Cayman and the reason I bought these wheels was because well I like the design that's the main thing I really like the sort of style but the all the cars I was looking at I was looking at sort of two or three year old Cayman um, they all seem to come with these black wheels which I really don't like um, I know a lot of people do but I just I just find it looks a bit a bit chavy um, so I bought these wheels ready for the the car I was going to buy or you know I was looking at a few different ones but since then because the prices of um, all the used cars at the moment seem ridiculous um, in the end I decided to just order a new one from Porsche so the for the extra few thousand I'm now getting a new one and and the GTS 4 4 litre and that comes with obviously different style wheels and I actually quite like those and I've specced it with silver wheels so I'll still use these wheels um, you know I'm gonna have a choice of wheel to to fit to the car um, what I'll probably do is take the, 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 new, the wheels off the car and store them so they stay perfect and uh, fit these but the yeah the quality of these wheels is they're nice but the finish of the paint I wasn't I'm not overly impressed with um, it's now a lot better um, so these fit perfectly apparently and the center cap it takes the standard Porsche center cap and I've fitted the uh, pressure sensors um, and they tested those they're fine they work so that should talk to the to the car properly and with this turtle wax stuff I definitely find this one is the better the best of the products I've used in terms of polishes um, I know people have been there's various um, videos on YouTube of people raving about this polish paste wax um, but really I don't notice a massive difference in in any polish I've used really we've even got some cheap well, I say cheap this is a bottle of all my old polishes that were um, 
lying on the shelf I just tipped them all into a empty bottle mixed it up so that's loads of different types of polishes um, it's a bit messy stuff white creamy stuff not very nice to use but the shine is still pretty decent I mean I think a lot of these products are slightly hyped for the money um, but the compound polish is good because it it definitely um, it just made a clearer um, it's, a, it's like a cutting compound basically a bit like tea cut um, so I think you're better off spending time um, if you want shine you're better off spending time with a compound before thinking about the polish and uh, what I did have a problem with as well one of these tires was actually losing some air after it's first mounted and it, it, it's it has stopped it stopped doing it so it must have been to do with when it was first seated on the rim um, I tightened up the valve core and the um, stem and I also inflated the tire over inflated the tire and just left it and and now it's fine it doesn't none of them leak any air so um, that was a relief Another thing I did was um, not going to see it very well, but the balance weight there they've all been colour coded as well, so they don't stand out. Um, so yeah, just got to wait for the car now, which could be months before it's ready, built.